Florida Power and Light has teamed up with Palm Beach Public Schools to bring Suncoast High's Next Generation Solar Education Station. It's a mini solar field that is connected directly to the school's power grid, helping to save some green while going green. Two teachers had a special training workshop by FPNL on the new green. solar array so they can bring back what they learned to the classroom. Students will be learning how the solar panels convert the sun's rays into electricity and have a chance to do solar related science projects. I have several kids that are doing their science fair projects this year on solar energy and they're using the FPNL solar panels behind me to, uh, to monitor, to gather data and to add to their research. What I'm doing is I'm testing the efficiency of solar cells at different temperatures. The solar panels that we have here, I think it's great because it's it's more of a large scale version of my solar, uh, my science fair project. I think we're really lucky. Uh, it's, it's exciting to see how it works. The school is one of only eight in the state. By putting a real life solar panels here at uh, Suncoast, the kids are really starting to think about other ways of energy generation. They're starting to work on projects. You know, they're looking to the future. Oil is a limited resource. We only have so much of it. So I think like based on my future, I don't want to be stuck with an oil based economy when like there's not enough oil left. And the new solar panels not only translate into education for the classroom, but also powering the classroom, about five to be exact. If you want to check out the power output of these solar panels, you can go online, WPTV.com, and we'll hook you up with a link there. Reporting from Riviera Beach, James Whelan, WPTV, News Channel 5.